Hey everyone, Rivers here, and this is the Minix Z84 III Pro. It's a Windows 10 mini PC with an ultra small form factor, lots of ports, and a couple of upgrades over the original Z84 III, which has been a best-selling mini PC on Amazon for most of 2017. So let's take a closer look. Let's start off with an ultra quick unboxing. So we've got the Z83 IV Pro itself, mounting bracket, HDMI cable, power cable, screws, and a manual. Now just pair the Z83 IV Pro with your existing USB keyboard, mouse, and a monitor, and you have a fully functional Windows 10 Pro 64-bit PC for $200 or maybe even less. Oh, and that mounting bracket that I showed you earlier, that's one of the coolest parts because it lets you mount directly to the back of a lot of monitors in the wall mount holes. That way you get that clean, all-in-one computer look like iMacs have, but of course for one-tenth the price. And the bracket is included with the Pro. So I think it's worth the extra $20 for the Pro version, just for the mounting bracket alone. But you also get a couple other upgrades from the non-Pro original version. You get Windows 10 Professional instead of Home. That's very useful for a lot of business users who are in corporate networks or people doing digital signage with the players. And personally, I like it because it gives you the remote desktop function on here. And finally, you get an upgraded processor from the Z8300 to the 8350. And I'd estimate it's about a 10 to 20% speed boost over it. So it's really nice to have. I love faster processors in these boxes. Now let's take a look at some of the other specs and ports on this computer. So it's got 32 gigs of flash storage. 4 gigs of DDR3 memory. It's got HDMI 1.4, which can go to 4K at 30 frames per second. It's also got a mini display port. And you also have gigabit ethernet and a headphone and audio in jack on the back. Over on the side, you've got a nice selection of USB ports. Three of them are USB 2.0 and one USB 3.0, as well as a micro SD card slot and your power button. So the port selection on here is excellent. You're gonna have plenty of room if you need to add USB devices. And if you have it mounted on the back and you wanna have a port up front, I use this little extension cable so I could plug in like a thumb drive or maybe a USB external hard drive and it works great. The Z83 IV Pro also works well as a media player. I tested it in Kodi and my favorite app, Plex, and it worked really well. So using Plex, I could stream up to 4K but when I went up to 4K at 60 frames per second, I think that was too much data and it couldn't keep up. But I tested that 4K at 60 frames per second on Kodi and it played it no problem, nice and smooth. And that is this video playing here and it's straight off the camera too, so it's a high bit rate video. So yeah, I would recommend it as a media player. It did a really good job, but the mousing around with Air Mouse Remote Controls I think is still easier in Android and that's why my first choice would be to use this as a PC. I find Android just easier to navigate with an Air Mouse remote control. This guy works great for web browsing, office work. It's actually pretty fast for those things. It's not gonna be a great 3D gamer, although I was able to use Microsoft's new 3D Paint Studio, and it could render those things in real time no problem, as you can see right here. So overall, this is a great little Windows 10 Pro PC. It's completely fanless and it has no moving parts, so it's nice and silent. I actually use one of these in my bedroom as a PC, so I don't ever have to listen to fan noise. I'll have a link to it in the video description down below, as well as the other accessories in the video, so please check those out. And if you like this video and you want to see more like it, hit that little subscribe button down there. That will help me out a ton. Thanks for watching, you guys, and as always, aloha.